Here we want to take a look at the car ADU um, ceiling plan, which is going to be our lighting plan. And then we're also doing an electrical plan um, in the same drawing. And here in this view, I've got the furniture turned on so you can see the placement of the different things. And there is a PDF attached um, with the drawing sheet uh, that we want to look at. So it's drawing sheet uh, A120. And this sheet's going to give us the the view of that lighting plan with the electrical um, symbols there without the furniture overlay, but you can use this one um, to mark up and whatnot. So let's look at it with the furniture on. So um, this is obviously a duplex. This is a, a quad located uh, behind the TV stand. And all of these duplexes are code required for the distance that we need on each wall. Um, we have a uh, two-way switch here uh, we need to the trickiest one is where to put the switch when you walk in this door I'm tempted to put the switch right here but you can see it's pretty far away i don't like to put switches behind doors so looking i'll probably add a switch right there for walking in we may want to do like a motion detector in this room so when someone walks in the room um, you get uh, some some lights turning on even if they're low lights maybe they're you know the task lights underneath the um, cabinets here or something like that just an idea um, but let's take a look um, so there are a couple chandeliers here and then can lights um, around the outside i like to put can lights around the perimeter to put some light on the walls and let it reflect into the room um, that generally we, we don't want the walls to go dark it makes the ceiling feel lower and the rooms feel smaller so um, these chandeliers provide task lighting directly down, so right on that table and right on um, that coffee table. And these chandeliers also will provide light up, uh, lighting the ceiling. So um, let's look at that really quick in um, our side view. So um, this is a sample uh, type chandelier, looking again, something kind of masculine. These are uh, wood and copper. Um, chandeliers and uh, I, I will, these are important pieces I think in here so um, I, have, I have some options uh, to show you guys uh, for what we might put here but I think the lighting becomes an important uh, design element in this room so you can see how these uh, two chandelier pieces start to work they're lighting the primary um, task areas and hangout areas and also are going to provide good light up on the ceiling because these can lights are primarily shooting down I, I want I would like these to be directional can lights so we can hit element you know hit the wall with them and not have them we don't want them shining down like this into the space we want them angled you know kind of coming back hitting the wall hitting the areas around the end because uh, these chandeliers are what's going to light uh, the the middle of the room and I think these have four um, four bulbs in them so pretty good amount of light that those chandeliers can can throw off there so um, most of the outlets and fixtures that I have in that in our in our drawing are going to be you know what, what's code required um, we need these three outlets by code for, for the countertop this guy needs a an outlet uh, we need an outlet there and 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 there so those are code required um, let me switch on something real i just want to turn on you know our, our x-ray really quick so we can see our outlet so we're gonna have um, you know one outlets above the counter here we're gonna have the outlet down here for the dishwasher and of course the outlet down here for the refrigerator this one got moved down i'd like to move this one up actually to this height so it's easy to uh, plug that in um, from the standing height so i'll do that and we're gonna have a 220 outlet here behind our our stove as well there it is um, right there um, so that's um, kind of our x-ray view of of those countertops there okay let's turn that back so let's pop out so anyway i hope that's the lighting concept for um for this room here, um, let's I'll jump back up to this view. So, so here you can see, um, so that those are those chandeliers we were looking at uh, over the table with lighting around the outside. Um, and uh, we just want to kind of review the the number. Uh, we have can lights in the bedroom around the outside. Um, some can lights down the middle of the bathroom um, there, and uh, additionally that that fan there. Um, couple cans in here a couple cans down the hallway and um, the next uh, thing I want to put on here is make sure we have the switching that shows what's connected to the different lights so I'll get you that um, on Wednesday to look out at because we just want to uh, re review that um, make sure it is how we want it and 
anyway, so um, check out the attached PDF and um, let me know if you have any comments on the, the lighting and outlets that we have shown at this point. And I will get you switching um, a little, the switching diagram uh, in the next couple days. We'll get that switching diagram. There's just our x-ray view of our design, which is, this looks kind of cool. All right, let me know what you think, thanks.